no problem. Um, yeah, let me welcome you to the first Cloud Sky Meetup and 25th Cologne Cloud Meetup uh, today together. Um, the subject is uh, hybrid Kubernetes with TK8. Uh, TK8 is a uh, tool that uh, Cloud Sky have developed um, from Cloud Sky. We have the founder and CEO, Arash, with us, who will do actually the, the most of the talking. And we have our chief software engineer, Christopher Adigon, with us. So, uh, let me just really briefly say what, what is what is Kubernetes? Uh, we've all heard this story, what Kubernetes stands for, the guy who steers the ship. Uh, it, is the lar it is now the largest open source project in the world. It's the container orchestration software. Uh, there were others, but it has kind of come, come out as, as the number one container orchestration software. What is TK8? Uh, TK8 is a tool that we have developed that allows us to install Kubernetes production ready upstream and in HA on a variety of infrastructure platforms. It's uh, completely cloud agnostic, so it would install on AWS, Azure, Google Compute, uh, on OpenStack, or even bare metal. Uh, TK8 supports multi cluster. Uh, and basically consists of a lot of uh, pre-compiled Go binary. Biggest benefit of using TK8 over uh, the cloud providers ba uh, baked in Kubernetes is that you A, retain control over the master and B, will be able to influence the version. So let's assume that you have an in-house OpenStack cloud, you have uh, AWS and you have Azure uh, using TK8 will install Kubernetes the same upstream Kubernetes version uh, on all of the platforms and you will be in control of the masters. TK8 is 100% uh, open source, it's written in Go and you can fork it on GitHub. <laughs> 